welcome back theme park wizard and today we are <laughs> i'm going to talk about 10 fun facts about splash mountain i'll link my other fun facts video and fun facts series about the manhorn up above below or <laughs> up above but right now i'm talking about my favorite ride at disneyland park and that is splash mountain the first fact is this attraction was origi originally called zippity doodah <laughs> river run but for dip for some reasons that we're going to get to in another fact its um, name was changed later in the development process. Very interesting reason and has to do with a movie based on Tom Hanks. Coming up to this number two reason, it is based on the movie Song of the South, which you can see these lovely characters and scenes are based from your the story as you're traveling down the river with Briar Rabbit and he's going on an adventure, but he gets in some trouble and he gets caught by Briar Fox, who eventually friends with him in his laughing place, which or the Briar Patch, which is where he was born, and he tricks um, a Briar Fox into throwing him into the Briar uh, Briar Patch, and that's the fall, the 50 foot fall down the drop. And what I said in that other fact was supposed to be based on the movie Splash with Tom Hanks, which was supposed to promote this new Touchstone Pictures label. But um, that didn't work out, but this name Splash stuck, and Mountain it was in the mountain, so they decided to stick the two together and make Disney's fourth name Mountain Splash Mountain. Which is incredibly interesting. And what's very interesting is the only Disneyland version features that's a rare U-shaped drop. Um, long plumes usually don't have this, and it's in the indoor um, section as you travel into the Laughing Caverns. It's where you drop, and you kind of come up a little bit. It's like a kind of a hump. It is a U-shaped drop, and it's again super rare for a long plume to have it. I think the only other one in the U.S. is at Islands of Adventure at Universal Studios, I believe. And switching over here, you see we switched videos, and that's because there's multiple versions of Splash Mountain. There are is one, the original one in Disneyland that opened in 1989, then the Magic Kingdom in Florida, and Tokyo Disneyland also has one. The Tokyo Disneyland version is just an almost carbon copy of the Magic Kingdom version, but slightly more indoor portions. Magic Kingdom and Tokyo are longer versions of the attraction. Magic Kingdom and Tokyo are about 10 and a half minutes, and the Disneyland version is about 9 and a half minutes long. And it's also, the Tokyo Magic Kingdom are slower versions, the Disneyland version kind of whips you up through a little bit, so a bit of a faster flume. The one thing about Disneyland's, uh, Splash Mountain is Disneyland's is located next to New Orleans Square. New Orleans Square, you have the Haunted Mansion in Pirates of Caribbean, and then you have Splash Mountain. So there's more of a jazz to the music as what's playing in the background here. Whereas in Tokyo and uh, Magic Kingdom, it's a, they're in their frontier land sections of the park. So it's more of a bluegrass um, country type of music, which is very interesting. They t make the music and pretty awesome. They make music to the, the themed land that it's in, which is great. But in all versions of the attraction, the top of the mountain is 89 feet and the drop is 50 feet. Tokyo and Magic Kingdom have double... <laughs> Double wide logs, two seats per row, it's about eight people. This land has a single row log for about six people. And also, what's very interesting about the Disneyland version is that there's a lot of cost cutting going on in Disney at the time in the 80s. So they were they retired the attraction America Sings. Um, that was I believe in Tomorrowland, and they reused those animatronics and just reprogram them for splat most of those animatronics for Splash Mountain. As you can see in this picture, you see there's the alligator and the geese as well. <laughs> Lastly, a really, really cool fact is the Zippity, the Zippity Lady, which is that rocking boat, is the largest Disney prop Disney largest prop Disney has ever made in either, in all of their parks. <laughs> the one at the Disneyland Resort is a little bit bigger than the one at the Magic Kingdom. Um, but I don't think one of the Disneyland Resort rocks as much, or rocks at all, as the one in the Magic Kingdom. So that's, but they all have the same amount of characters and everything, just the side, the side of the boats and the rocking is a little bit different. And those are my 10 facts of the Splash Mountain, at the three Splash Mountains. Some bonus facts is uh, Disneyland Paris does not have a Splash Mountain because 
it was just a bunch of cuts and also it's just quite fun because it's too cold in France during the winter time so Splash Mountain with their ramp have to be closed for several months of the year which just costs a lot of money and it just is not worth it um, for when it's cold most of the time because France is in Europe and gets hot but it's pretty cold throughout the year. The other Disneyland Hong Kong is built on a budget and Shanghai wants to try to be as different as possible so they don't have versions of Splash Mountain. Shanghai has a version of Grizzly River Run called something else. Um, and Hong Kong does not have a water ride, I believe. Other than that, um, if you like this fun fact series, please don't forget to subscribe below to the channel. Check out my other fun fact series about the Matterhorn uh, Bob says that I did yesterday. And also, definitely um, leave your suggestions below on what rides you'd like to see me do fun facts on. Does not does not have to be a Disney ride, it could be any ride at any theme park. It could be a roller coaster, uh, something at Magic Mountain, something at Cedar Point, or it could be something at Disney World. Um, my next one will probably be on the Tower of Terror, though the original Tower of Terror at Disney World. So list your rides below and what you want to see fun facts on, and I'll get to those this week <laughs> as I continue to try to do new videos, new types of videos. <laughs> While we're all in quarantine. Other than that, I hope you enjoyed the video and have a fantastic day.